for this Netflix show, I was I was seeing Chance the Rapper every night go um to the studio working on his album. Every artist work hard when it comes to the album. And all they care about when they do the album is how they're gonna sell, how people are gonna react, how uh, is is there's gonna be any records that's gonna be a hit record after it. So for me to put out an album, and everybody wants to say like, oh, you use your pregnancy for this, you use your pregnancy for that, like it's an excuse. No, it's not an excuse, my nigga. It was just an extra. You know what I'm saying? It was just an extra, cause every artist be busting their ass when they work for the album. I'm not gonna let no little fucking white boys motherfucking come at me all motherfucking day long. Man, man shut the fuck up and stay in your motherfucking place. Go drink your motherfucking milk, bitch. Fuck. I be too fucking nice to every motherfucking body. Suck my dick. Z Nation, those little boys she was referred to as funny as SH. You know what I'm saying? But Cardi, they are kids, like kids. It's a different way to address them. I probably will laugh and I probably will also teach them a little lesson. But you you telling them to suck your peen, you know? You don't even have one. But that's how you talk. But you go, you know people going to have something to say about that, right? <laughs> Y'all got to check that video out. <laughs> that stuff was hilarious. And then I see all these little motherfucking fans linking up. Y'all didn't even like each other a couple of months ago. Now that Cardi's a problem, y'all linking up? Y'all linking up? Y'all was cursing each other up a couple of months ago. Now everybody linking up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because it's like, y'all niggas is like Power Rangers. Y'all got to link up to be powerful and try to come bring one bitch down. You see the mess cardi you got an a scap award for best writer and you don't write your own album you got a grammy i forget the title i think it was best female rapper or something like that and you didn't write it you think that fans are that stupid that they're gonna stay under your mirage it's not gonna happen you gotta see that it takes you to be wise enough to understand that Write your own album, damn it, and they'll leave you alone. Damn. And I, and my thing is, right, like, if I ain't such a a shit ass bitch, and I'm tired of people saying, like, oh my god, all Cardi do is complain. No, shut the fuck up. I complain when I'm sick and tired of y'all shit. I don't always be complaining when I be talking about my politics and shit. Y'all be telling me to shut the fuck up. When I be talking about positive shit, y'all be telling me to shut the fuck up. When I be doing school jobs, y'all don't be giving a fuck. But when I talk my shit, oh, why she always complaining? Hey, you shut the fuck up. You complain about your job every single motherfucking day, bitch. So let me complain about mine. This is my job. Dealing with these motherfuckers is my job. So if I want to say something, I can say something. You complain about your dirty ass boss every motherfucking day. Now let me motherfucking complain, bitch. I be letting a lot of, I be letting a lot of uh, artists talk a lot of shit. Every day there's a bitch violating me, shading me. <laughs> Y'all really gonna wake me the fuck up. So that was that. Cardi is not somebody that I don't like. I like Cardi. I liked Cardi ever since she was on Love & Hip Hop. She introduced herself. Cardi is funny. Cardi is down to earth. Cardi can be... Damn, I do not want to get in an argument with her. Oh my God, I don't feel like all that. Okay? But I have to say that people... Yeah, celebrities. They are upset because they don't feel right about how you win in these awards. Over people that put creative energy into their work don't think for a minute like you said they work just as well as hard as you do it's not nothing different than them they put hours in they go into studio lockdowns they don't they neglect their families the same way it's nothing different so i get it but i don't get it i don't get it you the thing about it people know for sure you don't write your own stuff so well, how the hell are you getting these awards over people that do that are still nominees same categories you're nominated in they write you don't but you're getting the awards you got an ASCAP but you don't write these people don't care about that they don't they, they, they don't care about the fact that you upset they don't give a fuck about your being you pretty you know and you funny it's about I put my work in I want my bonus 
I want my bonus. And and at this point, if I was a celebrities, y'all need to go to the Academy Award Center. And y'all need to take this up with ASCAP, the actual organization. It's not Cardi B's fault that they're giving her these awards. You know, as far as it's not some we can't get mad at her. It's not about getting mad at Cardi. It's about going to the people that's shady and they know they shady as hell. They know they fraud and fake and shady. You know what I'm saying? They know that. So that's what I wanted to say and show y'all on this video. Like I said, if you want the heat off your back, let's see. Write your own album and see if you get a Grammy. Get a Grammy? I guarantee you people will be off your back. Because what else the hell are they going to say? What else we going to say about you if you writing your own stuff? At least 98% of it. If you putting your creative mind into your work. Not what they see. This is what I'm saying. This is people are saying that you're buying your success because if you're buying writers and you're getting the awards for it, what is that? They deserve the awards because I saw Partisan's video. I think that was Part Partisan where he was rap. He was on Instagram singing or rapping. Be careful. The same. Com it was composed the same. You said it the same way. You sing it or rapped it the same way. Same lyrics. Couple of them changed. So he deserves that award, not you. Now, if you want that narrative to change, you change it. Show them your skills. Get your writing out, pen and pad. Work for you. Like, why asking Offset? And we know it. We know what's going on because we saw the video where somebody said his Offset still gonna do that. That um verse now let me say alleged because we i don't i'm gonna take that somewhat back i don't know the true facts of what 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 is what with that but we heard it and then we saw other times when people wrote for you still getting people to write for you cardi you still not putting your energy in and you got a fucking nerve to get mad at z nation these little boys telling them to suck you off but you still not putting the work in and you acting like you don't know why people mad and you saying they they hate they ain't hating on you they want their honor that they deserve write your own album cardi get a grammy from that they will leave you alone guaranteed true so the real hard work is you actually using your mind to come up with lyrics to write that's the hard work not reciting or practicing what somebody wrote for you in studio in a studio that's not hard work that's easy work that's acting okay so if that's what you want to do pursue that but for now girl woman lady go write your own rap and then get that grammy will you get a grammy then do it and i guarantee you we'll leave you alone peace